again we continue our evaluation of think automation. Let's connect and let's look at the properties of this samples application or samples API account. Properties, right button click properties. Let's look at this tool called get via email. Read messages to be processed via IMAP pop 3 or exchange slash office 365 mail. Let's click on it and it opens the page. And let's say we want to read messages uh, using exchange or office 365. Let's click on it and EWS URL. You, we were supposed to fill this. Uh, out by replacing the exchange server with a um, with a path or, or um, which I never could never remember uh, but the discover discover is supposed to help you fill this out somehow we can get back to that uh, later uh, username you put in your username and the password that you use to sign into your exchange account. At this point, uh, it will let you have access to your default mailbox. You can you can have an option by selecting um, open other mailbox. That's if you have access to more than one mailbox. I'm not going to actually go through this because I don't think it will work on this computer. And then, once you click on Select button, it will let you select a subfolder within the account. Normally, it's an it's an inbox. So these are the ba the basic uh, steps that you would normally go through. That's all I wanted to show in this short video. More later.